come see Bluey with us. So this was me. I had just gotten in the car from daycare. I told mommy to get the camera out of my face. So she put it on my sister, but my sister was sleepy. I guess she had a long day today. These were our outfits. I got to wear the Bluey outfit because all of this was really for me, and I just let everybody else come with. So this was us. And then I tried to play tag with Bluey, but she didn't really want to chase me, so I decided we should just go inside the show. Um, the show was really, really funny, but there were a lot of people there. I don't really know why they were there. I just wanted to watch my girl Bluey, so I just tried to focus on her. Then they started turning the lights on, so I guess they wanted me to see all of these people, but I wasn't there for them. I was there for my girl, so I just tried to watch her. Um, they started throwing these balls around, so I had to give a little dance. I thought maybe if I did that, they would throw it to me. They didn't, so I just tried to give a little clap to get their attention. Still didn't work. Mommy tried to get my attention to take a picture. I wasn't feeling that. I really wanted one of those cool balls. Um, I tried to give a few more claps. They just wouldn't throw it to me. But overall, I enjoyed seeing my girl, Bluey. <laughs> Here's a line from Bluey that a lot of people get wrong. There's a really popular scene in the episode Ice Cream, where the ice cream is melted and Bluey says, so we get nothing, and Bandit basically says, well, you get a valuable life lesson, and Bluey says, I don't want a valuable life lesson, I want an ice cream. But the thing is, Bluey doesn't say she wants a valuable life lesson. She says she doesn't want a valuable lime lesson. This is even wrong in the captions on Disney+. Plus. And for those of you who don't believe me... <laughs> well, you get a valuable life lesson. I don't want a valuable lime lesson! I just want an ice cream. Bingo, ¿puedo utilizar la orden de baile con tu papá? Bueno, eso lo... Por favor. Ah, ok. Ya dijo que sí, ¿no, Bingo? Sí. ¿Ves? Entonces, ¿qué se supone que debemos hacer? Esto es confuso. Bingo, algunas veces dices que sí, pero realmente lo que estás pensando es un no. I just saw the most cursed bluey meme idea ever and I, I had to edit it. So I'm sorry. I'm gonna put these wet clothes on the line. Put these oh! Uh... oh I thought I was gonna feel all better. I'm sorry. That's okay. You tried your best. This episode of Bluey is called Daddy Put Down. <laughs> So pleased you picked us to distribute your show Blue. It's called Bluey, actually. Bluey, sorry. No, no worries. It's a lovable show about a family of cartoon dogs. Yeah, I was just looking through the episode titles, and I was hoping you could give me a quick synopsis of some of these. They sound really interesting. Yeah, happy to help. Let's start with camping. That sounds fun. This is just like a little campsite visit. Ah, so that episode is about the loss of a childhood friendship and whether or not it will ever come back. It sounds a little heavy. What about Granddad? Like a fun visit to Granddad's, yeah? That one's about a child struggling to communicate to their own parent that they need that parent to take better care of themselves because they still need them, and quite frankly, they're worried that they're going to lose them. Um, well, surely some of these have to be a little bit more upbeat. Uh, this one, this one, Baby Race. It's a study of a mother struggling with all the comparisons that she makes to other parents out there. And in the meantime, she is accidentally ignoring her brand new baby who is constantly reaching out and trying to get some kind of attention or affection. And really the breaking point for her is when uh, a more experienced mother comes to visit her and reassures her that she's doing great. And then at the end of the episode, um, her baby takes their first steps, walking towards her because they really wanted her. Space? Processing childhood trauma through play. Want onesies? It's about infertility. Come on, man, sleepy time? It's about how kids have to grow up, but their parents will always be there for them. 
Bro, what the fuck? C6, sir. Unicorn in the world. Guilty! A nice unicorn. I promise I can. Right, unicorn? Nah. Don't listen to him. Oh, I know. Unicorn, what's your favourite food? Children. Please, can you stay? Fine, but we're reading this book, not yours. You will live to regret that. <laughs> I can't. I don't have any money. Oh, see, yeah? see, just, just, just a couple of minutes ago, I met this guy selling nines, you see. Dad. Yeah? How does the baby get in the lady's belly? Oh. Ah! No, Hi, can you grab us the onions? Get them yourself. <laughs> Back here, guinea pig. I started just doing a wee, and now it's turned into a poo. <laughs> Bottomless. Hmm, this pillow isn't very comfy. Yes, it is. Oh, okay. I'm a walrus. Are you ready, Bob? presents to nice kids who are fast asleep. Dad, Dad, run your little sausage from work. Yeah, too slow, Mr. Mustard. I'm actually a bit nervous at hospitals. There's no need to be nervous. Hello! Yeah. Dear child, embrace your father. The blue icing and sprinkles. Sprinkles. I'm sick of this bitter! singing songs, mate. Don't think too hard about it. <laughs> oh, bingo. How does the baby get in the lady's belly? My friend, no. Oh, hello, doctor. My name is... <laughs> My heart is breaking. Swing! This is... Hi. How would you like to save $200 a year on your energy bill? Excuse me? What's wrong, bandit? 
You used to be able to lift spoons. Unicorns, what's your favourite food? Children. Go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep, big to never come. Oh, well, I guess it's nothing. Ah! Stretch marks. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. How does the baby get in the lady's belly? Well, Muffin is right in the middle of stopping that second little sleep during the day. Oh. Hey, Muffin! Skip to sleep. But you promise. No, she's fine. She just likes plants. Oh, it all looks so good, bud. Hello! Would you like some chicken? Run, Sheila! Okay! Whoa, Muffin. You really are tired. It mattered, though. Judo had won the baby race. Oh, biscuits. Are you upset with me that I lost the baby race? Yes! Oh, man. What? <gasps> Bluey! Why did you say, oh, man? Uh, I just need to do some exercise. Tell me about it. Oh, doo -doo. <sighs> Ow, <laughs> found you. Why don't you just do some exercise? Same old reason, Bluey. You kids and work. Us? Why don't you do it now? Because I'd be late for work. So? Well, that wouldn't make my boss very happy. How do you make your boss very happy? By not being late for work. Well, we won't get in the way of your exercise. And I think your boss would want you to be very happy as well. Yeah, maybe you're right, Bluey. Oh, man. Came from or so help me. Oh, hey, what do you want for McDonald's? Chicken nuggets and fries, sweet and sour sauce, and icy orange. <laughs> Girl, fuck them kids and fuck you too. Got to get back before Cleveland realizes I'm not in bed. Donna! Donna! <laughs> Wake up, mate! Ow! Bluey! 
Yay! Bingo, grab a suitcase. No. But you have to return your books. Otherwise, you're not playing library properly. What was it that Grandad used to say when he was a soldier? Hurry up and wait. Blink two times if yes. Baby loves his walkies! Oh, cheeky baby. Picking your dummy up. Don't worry, we we'll... Hey! Run away, baby! Lion hungry! <laughs> This pillow isn't very comfy. Yes, it is. Oh, okay. <laughs> and what about you? You're Ugh, I can feel my paws opening. Gorgeous. How much is this? Oh, uh, so buy four, get one free. I love the free one. No, gorgeous. You mean to pay for this? Gorgeous! It's easy. Go. Why don't you have a wife? Whoa. Unicorns. What's your favorite food? Children. Oh. She was very lonely. No, I wasn't. Suddenly, this big blue guy called. Um. Bandit. Bandit. Walked in. Alright, here we go. Do 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 Hi, bud. Smell this. Then, Bandit asked Chili to marry him on a romance trip to, um... Italy. Good job. <laughs> what? Marry me, bud. Oh, why should I? Because I love you, bud. I love your ears, bud.